But below the skyscrapers on Boston Avenue, we found a place that's still pretty much the same. Nelson's Buffeteria has been in this location since 1948. Next place. Nelson's is famous for its fast-moving buffet Nine line. Beef. Next place. We have the Nelly Burgers, we have the liver and onions, we have the beef tips. This is our chicken fried steak, which is world famous, and pan fried steak. We got corned beef and cabbage today, and we got the chicken and dressing, and we got the grilled chicken. You get uh, people in from really all over, and they've heard about the chicken fried steak here at Nelson's. Anyone who's gone through the buffet line here probably knows head cook Charlie Freeman. He's been dishing out the stick to your ribs food at Nelson's since the mid 1950s. I was just passing through. I thought I'd have me a job for a couple of days, get some pocket change, and then I'd, I'd move on. <laughs> All I can say, you get up every morning and keep coming back, that's why 43 years have gone by on you. <laughs> OK, mashed potatoes and gravy. Yes, yes. And broccoli. Uh, yeah. yeah, OK. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Nelson Rogers, Jr. Okay, owns the place. He took over from his late dad, Nelson Sr., who opened a diner in 1929 in a smaller downtown location. And so this is uh, at 4th and Main, and he was just right there between Boulder and Maine on 4th Street. That's the original location. It was just a counter and a couple of booths back here in the back. This cash register that you see in this photo is still the one we're using up front. Five even, thank you. Behind the cash register is a board showing how long each employee has been here. It's something they're very proud of here at Nelson's because they have a history of great waitresses. Many have worked here for a long time. It was 38 years ago when Louise came here to start waiting tables. You guys want anything to drink? Huh? Uh, I think I'm okay with water. Just water? Mm -hmm. I join my Hello. customers. We get to know them real well and know their families, you know, from generations, and we enjoy it. And Lucille, who's getting ready to retire, worked here 31 years. I started with an old Mr. Nelson and Mrs. Nelson, then I stayed on with him when, he come, when they passed on. And I love the public. I know everybody downtown. I have my stations full every day with attorneys and lawyers and judges. <laughs> when you have an old diner like Nelson's, it attracts people who like to reminisce about the past. Sure. Sydney Stellinger has been a regular since the 1930s. It's a home feeling. They have, the menu's the same. The menu hasn't changed. Can't beat something that's good. It's always good. 